how to use tasks and reminder in google calendar hi guys welcome back today i'm going to be showing you how you can use google calendar add task reminder and create events and more so let's get started first what you have to do is you will simply open up your google calendar this is a beginner's tutorial and i will help you with everything and i will tell you everything you need to know in order to use your google calendar like a pro so to access your google calendar what you have to do is you will simply go to your google and then you can simply go to google apps right here and you will be able to find your google calendar from here simply open it up if you have a Google account, then you don't need to create an account for Google Calendar. You simply get it with your Google account. So now we have our own Google Calendar. Let me show you how we can create different lists and different tasks in our calendar. First of all, you can see right here, we have this create option right here, which allows us to create an event or a task, or we can simply go ahead and select a date. Let's say that I want to add a task on Friday, and this is the time. So let's add a task on Friday at 10 p.m. So I will simply click right here and it will allow me to create an event, task, or add a reminder. So I will actually show you one by one how to create an event, then task, and then reminder. So let's create an event first. What you have to do is you simply add the title for your event. Let's say that I have to go to an important meeting. So I'm going to go ahead and type in the title. Then what I can do is simply select the time. So this is the date and this is the time. If you want to, you know, customize the time, you can simply go ahead and do that. Then we have the option of repeat. If this event is going to repeat itself, you can go ahead and add a repeat option. Let's say that this meeting is going to be weekly on Friday. Then I can select this option or it is going to be on this date every year, or maybe it is going to be happening every weekend. So I'm gonna go ahead and just select doesn't repeat because this meeting is not going to repeat. But you can simply go ahead and save your time by adding this option. Then we have event details. In event details, you can simply go ahead and add your Google Meet video conference link, add a location, add a notification. Let's say that you want a notification 30 minutes prior to the meeting. I'm going to go ahead and add a notification for 20 minutes. Then we have our calendar and color. Let's change the color for this meeting. I'm going to give it a yellow color. Then we have busy and visibility option and it is going to be default visibility. Then you can simply go ahead and add your description here. To invite guests to this meeting, you can add their email address right here and then you will be able to invite them. Simply click on save and you can see right here, a new meeting will be created and I can actually, you know, expand it a bit. There you go. So this is my event. Now let's go ahead and create a task. So let's create a task for Saturday, 7 p.m. So I will simply click right here and now I will select the option of task. To create a task, again, you simply have to add a title and I need to add a task so I'm going to call it work task. Then again, we can select the time and then repeat option right here. And you simply go ahead and add description. And from here, you simply have to select your calendar. I'm going to select my task. Simply click on save and your new task will be saved right here. This is how you create a task. Now let's create a reminder. So I'm going to add a reminder for 10 p.m. on Saturday. So simply go to reminder now. And now we simply just have to select our time and then repeat option. Doesn't repeat. And then we have all day option and this is the time. It is going to be 10 p.m. Simply click on save and a new reminder will be saved. You can also give your reminder a name, of course. So this is a reminder for me to send an email. So I'm going to click on save and you can see right here now I will be reminded to send an email at 10 p.m. on Saturday. So this is how you create an event, task and reminder on Google Calendar. How to access your tasks and how to change the color for your task. You can see right here these are all my calendar. 
if I want to just access my task, then I can select this calendar right here and it will show me my tasks. And you can see right here that I can change the color for my tasks. So I have selected red. Maybe you can select purple. And there you go. You will have your color for a task. Then we can select reminders and it will only show me the reminders on my calendar. Again, I can change the color for my reminders as well. And then we have our calendars. If I select all, then they will show me my events, add reminders and task collectively. If you want to check that you have a reminder or task on a day, you can simply go to a day view. And it will only show you your daily view where you will be able to see your task and your reminders. You can see right here on Saturday, I have all of these different tasks and a reminder. And then I can also go to a monthly view and it will show me that what kind of task and events I have created on my Google Calendar. Let's go back to our weekly view. So this is how I have created different tasks and events. If you have completed a task, what you have to do is you simply click right here and click on mark completed and it will be checked right here. If you want to delete an event or maybe a task, you can simply go ahead and select the task, go to delete and your task will be deleted. This way you can simply go ahead and customize your Google Calendar experience. If you want to share your calendar with people, you can simply go ahead and share your calendar as well. Another way to create a task or event is simply go to this option right here which says create and select event or task. And then you have to select the date and time. And again, the process is going to be similar. This way, you can simply use your Google Calendar as a to-do list as well. And now you have an idea how to create an event, task, and reminder on your Google Calendar. You can simply go to Reminder and mark as done when you are done with the reminder as well. Let's say that I have done this thing that I will simply click on mark as done and it will be checked. Again, I can simply add a reminder, click right here, go to reminder, add the title and then click on save and a new reminder will be created. We can also move one task from one day to another by just simple drag and drop. And this is how you simply use your Google Calendar. So yeah, guys, this brings us to the end of the video. I hope that I was a big help to you. And now you know how to use tasks and reminders in Google Calendar. If I were a big help, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to the YouTube channel.